What's going on? Joey here. So today I came to a little downtown area in my college um, to fly my drone around a little bit, see if I can get some cool shots. Um, I have the Phantom 4, um, if you guys didn't know. Uh, it's right here. Um, but I'm thinking I'm gonna get some cool, I'm gonna try to at least get some cool, maybe like shots of the intersection, you know, maybe time lapse of cars going by, whatnot. Okay, take the gimbal clamp off. I don't know if I need this, but I always put it back on. Ah, and of course I forget my iPhone cord. Every time I drive somewhere to film, I always manage to leave my iPhone cable in the car. Okay, let's go ahead and launch the DJI GO app. Come over here, we're gonna start this, pressing once, then holding for three seconds, and then it's gonna go doo -doo -doo. Pretty good impression, huh? Okay, uh, blah, blah, blah. Oh, gotta turn the controller on, of course. The controller battery life, let me tell you, is insane. I've, I don't know, I can't tell you how many flights I've done with the drone uh, so far, but I've done quite a few, and I've yet to charge the controller more than the, than the first time I charge it. It's, it's pretty freaking crazy how long the battery life of the controller is. Okay, so the plan here, is there's an intersection that's like right here. I'm gonna try to hover directly above the center of it. Um, <laughs> we'll see how that works. Boom. Okay, swag, swag -oo. Okay, got 15 satellites, so we're good to go. Okay, now I got some trees in the way of right off the bat, but I'm gonna try and just get above those for now. I need one of those little uh, things that cover the screen. That's, oh yeah, the wind is really gusting. I'm a little bit worried, but we're gonna see how this goes. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and tilt my camera all the way down like straight down okay so to get the shot I want anyway I'm gonna need to go higher in altitude so at least I'm not gonna have to worry about hitting any trees oh this is actually gonna be a kind of cool shot I'm excited all right so let me just try to center this up now I do not recommend going solely off your controller screen your phone screen but sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. Okay, I like this. I like this a lot. So I am just going to, okay, it's been a minute 47. I'm gonna let that sit for five minutes. Now, now that I'm thinking about it, I should, I feel like there's a setting on there. I could have just done it without shooting 4K for five minutes and having a thousand gigabyte file. But uh, that's what you get for your first time. Drones in the sky. I'm just walking over to the intersection to check it out. It seems to be, seems to be pretty steady, not gonna lie. Let's see if I can show you guys. I just stopped the recording, so I'm gonna go ahead and fly us back. And there we go. Now, one thing I get asked a lot about the drone, besides how much was it, um, <laughs> was how, is how far does it go? And one of the reasons why I got the Phantom 4 over like the Phantom 3, 3 Pro, was that um, the signal radius 
uh, significantly boosted, you know, as well as obstacle avoidance and, and um, in like some other cool like sport or uh, the tracking and all that cool stuff. So besides that, you know, the distance, I believe it's three miles as far as the controller signal. Now, have I tested it? No. Now, I've gone pretty far, but I don't think I've hit the three mile radius uh, or three mile signal length. But um, one thing that I kind of am interested in getting are these little copper plates that you put on the propellers and it basically, some say it even doubles that, that, that distance. So like, who knows how far I can go? I mean, I probably can't go to LA or anything, but um, it could definitely go pretty far. So even like six miles or something. All right, guys, unfortunately, I think that's gonna have to do it for today. I wanted to get some more shots, but the wind, it's picking up even more than it was before, and I just, first off, it's kind of chilly, <laughs> and uh, I just don't think it's gonna be, it's gonna make for some great, I don't think it's gonna make for great shots with the drone. So um, I'll, I'll probably get some more tomorrow. Hopefully uh, it'll clear up and be a nice day. Um, but if you guys wanna see some more of these videos, just definitely let me know in the comment section below. Um, definitely gonna start posting more drone footage um, onto YouTube. So be on the lookout for that. Drop a like if you enjoyed it, and we'll see you guys later.